Hi, welcome to Troubadour's videos. Today we're going to take a look at AMD's Radeon HD 6970. And here it is. This is the XFX brand AMD Radeon HD 6970 graphics card. Now, this is the latest blazing fast GPU from the AMD camp. Comes armed with a ridiculous 2GB of GDDR5 memory. So let's get this GPU out of the box, check out the GPU, and let's have a look at some of the accessories that come with this insanely fast graphics card. Okay, in the actual packaging itself, you get a little informational guide for the XFX brand Pro Series power supplies, your North American limited warranty guide, quick installation guide, XFX driver CD install guide, and of course your AMD graphics card drivers. In the second partition here, in a little secret compartment, you get your crossfire bridge. And of course, the XFX Gamer door tag with serial number. And here it is. The Radeon HD 6970 graphics card. Let's have a closer look at this card, check out some of the features of this card, and we'll be putting this in the, the actual test bench here, and overclocking the card, as well as running some performance benchmarks, uh, like 3D Mark 11, etc., and see exactly how this card compares to some of the others on the market. To ensure the Radeon HD 6970 runs as cool as possible, it is armed with the vapor chamber cooling technology. Now, this is an external exhaust or external venting graphics card, which means the cool air is sucked in through the fan, it's flowed across the cooler itself and vented out of the back of the graphics card. On the back of the graphics card, we do have two mini DisplayPort connectors. These DisplayPort connectors are compatible with DisplayPort 1.2 outputs. We also have a full-size HDMI connector. Now, this HDMI connector is HDMI 1.4A compatible, so it does come with support for stereoscopic 3D. We also have two DVI connection ports and a vent for venting the heat off this graphics card. On the side of the card, you have your two Crossfire bridges. Now, the HD 6970 is Crossfire X compatible up to some crazy, insane 4-way Crossfire X. Here we also have our 8-pin and 6-pin power supply hookups. Minimum power supply recommended by XFX for this particular graphics card is a 650-watt power supply. The HD 6970 also comes armed with the dual BIOS. Now to access this functionality, you'll need to utilize this two position switch. Position one is unprotected and therefore user firmware flashes and updates. Position number two is protected and is the default BIOS settings for this card. Now this is a real nice function uh, because previously, if you flashed the firmware on your graphics card and had a bad flash, the card was essentially bricked and rendered useless. Now you simply flick it back to the factory protected BIOS setting, reflash the card, and get yourself back up and running. One thing worth noting is previously XFX had a modder friendly warranty, which basically meant you could add water blocks to your graphics card without voiding any form of warranties. It does appear that this has changed slightly due to the anti-tamper tags on this graphics card. So if you want to add a water block to this card, you will definitely void those warranties. So 
So let's have a closer look at some of the key features of this graphics card. We will be putting this graphics card on the test bench and comparing it to some of the other GPUs available on the market. So don't forget to check back for those benchmarks. Thanks again for watching Troubadour's videos. I hope you enjoyed this video and don't forget to subscribe to us on YouTube and Facebook if you want to stay up to date with the latest and greatest in extreme PC and gaming hardware.